What's up guys, welcome to Terry Vision. This is the Z Olympics. Woo! Welcome ladies and gentlemen to the first annual 2018 Dizzy Olympics! Yes! Come on! I'm your host, Hitchin Ramond. It is my duty to keep you up to date with all the dizziness that's going on. Make sure to like and subscribe with those bell notifications on. And with all that being said, let's meet our contestants. Hi, my name's Jason. I'm here for second place. Hi guys, I'm Bensel, and I'm here for the buds. Hi guys, I'm Terence, and if as long as I finish in the top three, I'm happy. Team top three in the comments. Well, it looks like quite a tough bunch, but boy, that Terence is a handsome fella. My gosh. Right, first event is the penalty shootout. The objective of this task is to get the ball as close to the middle of the goal as possible. Let's see how they get on with it. Right, so it looks like Jason's up first. <laughs> well, that was quite a um, display to say the least. Both Jason and Vensel missing the target completely and ending up on their back. So let's take a look at the leaderboard after the first event. As we can see, we got Jason with one point as he came last after that dismal attempt. Vensel with two points as he came second in that event and Terence taking a strong lead with three points at the top of the leaderboard. Okay guys, we're calling this one Big Balls, Little Balls. Let's get into it. Right, the next event, Big Balls, Little Balls. As you heard Terence say there, I couldn't have said it better myself. Well done Terence. The objective of this is to get the big ball as close to the little ball as possible. Grab it, grab it, ball it. Ooh. Too long. Oh. Jason going a bit too long there with the throw. <laughs> Vensel going second. Too also hard. a bit too hard, but looks pretty close oh, to sorry, Jason yeah. to Jason's ball. <laughs> Terence going for a two-handed oh, tactic. Uh, a softer throw, let's Ooh. see how it fares up. Ooh, early celebrations there. We're gonna have to measure this because they are quite close. We got Jason up first. That looks like eight feet approximately. Next up is Vensel, also eight feet approximately. Lastly, we have Terence coming in with seven and a half feet. Wow, taking the win for that event. Let's take another look at the leaderboard. As you can see, Vensel and Jason tied that event, so both getting a second place, giving them two points each. Terence taking the lead, getting another three points. Uh, if you want to place your bets now, I'll put my money on Terence. Next up, we have the long jump. Pretty simple, jump as far as possible. Jason with a strong five cone leap. <laughs> Vensel slipping up just as he's about to leap, getting zero cones. Warp speed. Ah. <laughs> We're gonna have to take another look, it's pretty close. 
Oh, unfortunately, only four cones for Terence, giving him second place, giving Jason the win for this event, and Wenzel a dismal last place. As you can see, Terence is sitting strongly on top of the leaderboard with the others falling just behind. There's still time for them to catch up though, so don't lose hope out there, people. Our next event is the 100 meter dash. It's not actually 100 meters, I'll let you people in on a little secret. Uh, when you're dizzy, it's a bit hard to run that far. And Terence takes the win for the 100 meter dash. Benzel coming in a close second and Jason finishing last. Unfortunately, Jason went out the night before drinking and yeah. Right, on to our next events. Uh, we have the, sorry, one second, yes, hello. Oh, okay, okay, um, this just in. The events has been postponed due to bad weather. Um, this was meant to be 10, there was meant to be 10 events. We're going to have to take this up at a later date when the weather is more favorable of everyone. Guys, to ensure you don't miss out on part two of this Dizzy Olympics, make sure you've got that bell notification on. And with that being said, I'm your host, Hitchard Ramond. See you next time. Someone give me a beer, please. This is hard work, guys. Come on. Seriously. Ugh. You got me commentating all day long for nothing these guys don't even know how to spin in a proper circle it's it's ridiculous oh hey i forgot to tell you guys we've got a second channel link in description top line behind the scenes uh updates vlogs that sort of thing go subscribe there as well uh yeah cheers for now and make sure you come back for part two uh yeah what what is what what's hitchard raman's catchphrase what should it be mm, maybe like um hitchard raman out um hitchard raman we'll see you next time uh yeah i don't know make sure you go to our second channel guys we can decide there uh yeah doing pretty well second channel it's actually doing better than this one but we'll get into that on that channel uh, I'm just going to keep talking for, has it been 20 seconds yet? Has someone got me a beard yet? Come on. Boy, that Terrence was a handsome looking fellow though. Hey, gosh.